Hey guys, it's Abby. Wait, I can't talk with these in. Hey guys, it's Abby, and today I will be doing another Halloween costume video. And today I will be doing a vampire makeup tutorial. So if you want to find out how I got this look, then just keep on watching. So first I will start out with the Neutrogena Skin Clearing Oil Free Foundation in the shade 20. And I will just be applying that all over my face with a Real Techniques Beauty Blender. Next I will be taking my old Coastal Sense eyeshadow palette and I will be taking the darkest brown color with my e.l.f. eyeshadow brush and I am just putting that all over my eyebrows because I wanted to make them super dark and give them more of a vampire look. Now I will be taking my NYX color correctors and I am using the purple shade with my Real Techniques Beauty Blender and I will just be applying that to my under eye to give it a good base for the dark circles that we will be creating. Now taking this dark purple shade, I am just taking my finger and applying that to my under eye in a patting motion in basically the area where on a normal day you would want to highlight to brighten up your under eye. Now taking that pinky reddish shade, I will be taking my finger once again and I am patting it into the inner corner of both of my eyes. Then with that dark periwinkle shade, I will be patting that into the outer corner of both of my eyes. And now using the same dark purple shade that we used before underneath our eyes, I am taking my e.l.f. eyeshadow brush and I'm applying that all over my eyelids and then I am also adding a little bit more underneath my eyes to darken them up some more. Taking the black, I will be using the same e.l.f. eyeshadow brush and I'm applying that all over my eyelids and then I am also going to be applying that underneath my lower lash line. Now I will be using my Maybelline Eye Studio Paint Pot and I will be using it to apply some winged eyeliner. For mascara, I will be using the Maybelline Colossal Volume Express Mascara in Waterproof and I am applying that all over my upper eyelashes and my lower eyelashes. Once I am done with mascara, I will be using my L'Oreal Voluminous Smoldering Eyeliner and I will be applying that to both my upper and lower waterline. Finally, for the last steps, I will be taking the ColourPop Ultra Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade More Better and I am just applying that all over my lips and then I will be taking a red lip liner and I will be applying basically a line from either side of my mouth to give it an appearance like there is blood dripping down from the side of my mouth. Then I will be taking my ColourPop Liquid Lipstick once again and I will just be dotting that over the lip liner and then I'm taking my finger and just smudging it out because I thought it would give it a more blood like appearance. Finally I thought it would be fun to add some fake vampire teeth to finish it off but I accidentally put them upside down because I didn't know it made a difference but I just removed them and applied them the correct way but as you saw from the beginning they are definitely a little bit hard to talk with so if you're going to a party or will need to be talking a lot I wouldn't recommend them. 
So that is all I have for this video. This is the final look. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I will leave all of the products that I used in this video linked down below in the description. And give this video a big thumbs up and click the subscribe button down below because I will be posting a few more makeup tutorials for Halloween costume ideas as Halloween gets closer. And thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye. Ooh, gross.